Hello and thanks for tuning in. I'm Holly Shields for Calkine Media and welcome to another edition of Executive Corner Expert Talks. Today I'll be shedding light on Irreverent Labs, a company that's reinventing how games are played, owned and watched by merging advanced machine learning, engaging gameplay and blockchain tech. And joining us today to share their insights is CEO Rahul Sud. Rahul, thanks very much for joining us on the show today. Thank you for having me. It's a pleasure to have you on. Now, first and foremost, let's talk Mecha Fight Club. It's looking incredible so far with lots of hype from the gaming space. And congratulations on the 40 million raised for it last month. That is an amazing feat. How is that funding being used and what stage of development is the game at at the moment? Um, yeah, so we, um, my, my partner and I started, uh, started Irreverent Labs sometime late last year, around September. Um, and uh, we've been building this uh, this this incredible game. Uh, that's it's like a fighting game where every every character in the game is an artificially intelligent NPC uh, living on the blockchain as an NFT. And um, and and really, like we're 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 a deep tech company building deep technology around this this video game that we're creating. Um, and uh, we've we've made a lot of traction. So so basically, in the last month. Um, month or so, we, we were approached by our lead VC, who you know was looking for an update, and we shared where we were. We shared our our uh, roadmap, the technology we're building, and the size of our community as it continues to grow. And they felt that there was sort of no need to wait. We can just you know continue to raise the money that we need to to keep going and and build. So we raised another forty million dollars total of uh, forty five, um, and uh, the development of the game is going really well. That's incredible and uh, great to hear. It does sound like a major project there. And uh, lots of people are taking notice. It's getting a lot of traction, as you just said. So congratulations on that front. And um, as you said as well, you did only start late last year, I believe, which, uh, you know, you've seen some incredible growth so far and such tremendous success since that time. How have you achieved all of this in such a short span? Um, you know, I, I, I'll, I'll just say that uh, the, the market is amazing. You know, I, I've been in the gaming industry most or all of my career, really. I've had uh, multiple companies in the gaming space. My last uh, company was an esports uh, betting company uh, that got acquired by Entain. And uh, it, was, it, was, it was the largest esports betting company in the world. It was called Unicorn. And my partner who joined me, um, we used to work together at Microsoft. We started Microsoft Ventures together and we worked there for a few years. Um, and then and then he, he went off into the venture space and started making investments of his own. And we got back together last year uh, just to talk about the future, where things are going. And, um, you know, I shared this, this kind of really ridiculous idea I had for a video game. You know, I, I always say it jokingly, it's the dumbest idea I've ever had, but it's, uh, it's pretty amazing. Uh, and he... He brought in this this vision of AI and machine learning to it because that's his expertise, um, and uh, and and how we've made so how we've grown so quickly or made so much traction is really in the fact that we hired people that we've worked with in the past, people that we're very familiar with, um, that are you know like superstars in what they do. Um, you know, we hired the best creative artists we could. Um, you know, cinematics, music, storytelling, all of that. We put it together in this you know, this amazing company, and uh, we just we just started building. Right, well, it sounds like you've got a very solid framework there and a great team to back you up. So it has been an incredible journey by the sounds of it, and uh, we definitely look forward to seeing everything you have coming up. Now, in your opinion, I'd love to know how exactly is blockchain tech transforming the entire gaming industry? Uh, well, that's a really good question, because like I would say that, you know, it, it's still very early. Um, and, and I think the, the better question would be, how, how can it transform the industry? Because at the moment, there's a lot of speculation. Uh, you know, there's a lot of NFTs being dropped and that sort of thing. And really, the market is driven by um, mostly speculators who, who really don't care about, you know, the games or the things that are being produced. However, um, <clears throat> the promise of blockchain is super interesting. So the, the, way, the way we're applying it is, you know, we're, we're creating these characters that are individually unique, beautifully created characters with their own individual personalities that are driven by AI. And the user owns those characters, which is different than any game that you've seen. It's never happened like this before, where, where users actually own the characters in the game and they're all individuals. So 
we're building a, uh, a game with deep storytelling, a really amazing economy and, um, and, and, and an amazing technology layer that will allow people to have an emotional bond with the characters that they own. There's nothing like this that's ever been done before. So, you know, it's, I, I, it's gonna sound ridiculous, but we're building a mecha cockfighting game, you know, where, where these, these roosters and hens hatch out of eggs and, uh, and you own those, um, you know, you own those characters. And, um, and, and I think the key is that emotional connection that we're creating between the players and their characters will make this game super interesting and very engaging. That is awesome to hear. I don't doubt that. I mean, it's a, it's a great idea, I must say. Um, it looks like it'll be a great game as well. And um, I think you're absolutely on the money there when you say that the way ownership, um, as we know it in games, is completely changing with the blockchain tech. So that is uh, great to see. And uh, it's great to see as well that deep connection, I think, between players and characters um, that's really being fleshed out with this technology. So uh, overall, very good to see there. And, you know, I'd just love to know, what are your plans going forward for Irreverent Labs uh, in the upcoming year and near future? Yeah, look, you know, we're 100% we're focused on building Mecha Fight Club. Um, this, is, this is the game that we're building. Irreverent Labs, as I mentioned, is a deep tech company uh, building really great technology around AI and machine learning. Uh, and we, we're building software to build automated pipelines for game developers. We're basically building a game that any other game studio would require 200 people. We're doing it with 20 people um, and, and, and really good software. And, and so, um, so, you know, our plan is to continue building this and stay 100% focused on building and launching a series of experiences around Mecha Fight Club. And um, it's going to be interesting to see to see where it goes because we're a Web three game studio, and we're very um, open to you know all kinds of um, uh, sort, sort of industries coming into the space. Like for example, you know we're, we're building this um, this this mecha cockfighting game with a global community. We've got people all over the world that are really into what we're building right now, and we've had uh, many industry players in the in the wagering business contact us because that was my previous business asking if at any point in time will we open this up to wagering companies and and the answer is yeah like we'll do it but we won't we won't take bets ourselves what we'll do is we'll we'll license the technology the vision uh we'll give them odds and and all the streams and and the data that they need to to operate in a in a regulated environment on their platforms um and i think this is kind of the future of where entertainment is going and that's amazing to hear. It sounds like uh, you've got an expansion in the works from the sounds of it across sectors, and I'm sure we'll be seeing plenty more projects uh, from you as well in the near future. So all around, uh, really exciting stuff and uh, great to see. But uh, with that said, thanks very much for coming on the show today and sharing that with us. It's been really great to have you on Executive Corner Expert Talks. Thanks for having me. Appreciate it. Pleasure to have you on. Thanks for your time as well, viewers. If you've just joined us, that was Rahul Sood, the CEO of Irreverent Labs, doing some incredible work in the space. So do keep an eye out. And if you missed any part of the chat, you can catch the full interview on our YouTube channel at Calkine Media. I'm Holly Shields, reminding you to stay apprised and invest wise with Calkine.